Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of the Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes Let's Play series. And uh, we're back on the Hogger Tables right here. We got a donation delivery from uh, my guild. I actually did get a new guild if I didn't tell you guys. I didn't really want to stay in a starter guild. Uh, I don't think you guys can even join it because um, it's 50 uh, players max and we're all maxed out. I was the last one to join. Uh, the Force Beyond the Bounty. So we got a good guild GP. I'm obviously not going to be doing too many raids because I need 6 star and 7 star characters to get my rewards. But that's okay. So, uh, hey guys, welcome back. And uh, we're back on the whole tables, like I said. And uh, today we're just going to be doing some dailies. Oh, and by the way, guys, I hit level 40 uh, last night. I didn't want to do any Galactic War. I wanted to do it for the first time with you guys. So, yeah. I'm just wondering what team should I verse in here because there's some very good teams in here. I think I can take this um, this Ben Skywalker team maybe. Phoenix is a complete death to us right now. Um, I already tried versing Phoenix like uh, last night when I was doing an extra squad arena battle. Yeah, they they wrecked me. Uh, let's stun Luke. Can we take you down? Buff immunity. Big hit. Okay. Uh, we might want to heal up. If Dooku can get a hit in here, we might want to stun Luke. Because he's like the most powerful character. No stun. Okay, we're going to need to go all in on Luke. He's got a backup plan, so let's not take him down. He's obviously going to hit big. Ooh, okay, we're good. Um, just wait for that backup plan maybe to wear off. Uh, probably go for Leia here. Ooh, okay. Can you back off, Luke? Back off my Dooku. My Dooku will wreck you. <laughs> oh, okay, our Dooku's dead. All right, let's just take Luke down here, and we're gonna have to take him down for real now. Okay, come on. No. Big hit. All right. And we healed, so that's good. All right, yeah, okay, so we should be good. I knew we could take this team. I was just worried about Luke, because Luke's at four stars, and he's um, at gear four. He was their most powerful character. Sabine's does Sabine does big damage, except she didn't have a good star level. So, yeah. All right, there we go. So, uh we'll probably do a uh cantina sim i also tried to do tier two of the uh, cantina i didn't get enough energy to finish it come on eight shards that's not really good enough i mean come on now and we got some more uh some more ahsoka shards she can go to five stars soon that's insane guys i was doing this exact farming path on my main account my good account uh where is it oh no you didn't see my ally code um <laughs> uh my good account i was i've been doing the same strategy as this everyone and for some some odd reason um i just um it took me forever like when i reached level 50 i started to oh no yeah when i reached level 50 i i, I first got my seven star character but ahsoka got to seven stars at like level 60 70 um she got to five stars at around level 50 55 if not if i'm not really productive probably level 60 but that's insane because i've got nearly a five star circa i'm not getting my hopes up because i only just got the first 10 shards but i nearly got a five star circa already and that's insane i'm not even past level 40 i'm just on level 40 i'm not past it all right, so here's the tough battle, apparently. So we're going to get Chewy taunting here. Tenacity, buff immunity. Oh, we got we got buff immunity on the him. All right, we need Dooku to get in here and hit someone. Come on. Bam. Oh, where's the second hit, man? All right, there we go. That was pretty easy because I had my Dooku for my good account at gear 9. All right, so that's tier 3 done on that. So that's pretty good. Uh, we probably want to sim some Count Dooku shards right here. Alright, come on. Oh, six shards. That's a good drop right there. That is a good drop. Uh, okay, get some more Count Dooku shards. Okay. 
six shards again. That's 12 shards in one day, everyone. I might actually want to do a um, refresh on him because I actually uh, want him really good quickly at um, four stars. What do I need for this? One of these. That's easy. We're going to take... Um, What's his name? Gene Asian Soldier to gear five. There you go. Can we take him to gear six? No way we can do this today, guys. No way we can do this. There's no way. What do we need? This? I can get that. I can get that, guys. We can have a, a gear six. I just had to do a refresh because I'm um, going to get some more counter two shards anyway. Oh, what's... Oh, this. This is what I probably won't be able to get. No, I can. I can. What? Come on. I just need one more. So I go three. Yes. Yes. Guys. No way. We just did that. Oh, he's, oh he needs to be level 43. That's why. Uh, yes, we got to wait till we level up so he can level up. <laughs> oh, yeah. And I also have a gear five Dooku if I didn't mention already. What do you need? these we can get three of them today there you go there you go we'll get a gear for ahsoka here daring padawan we want to upgrade that ability every day of the week that's great that is great our characters are already getting geared up like a lot so that's really great what's our power nine three seven nine that's all right uh, so we're probably gonna want to get some more Count Dooku shots because I want to get him today. Yes, I'll use 25 crystals on it. Come on. Yes, there it is. There it is. Okay, that's good. So now we've got a four-star Dooku. That's insane, guys. He, that's really good, actually. Like, that's really damn good. He's catching up to a Ahsoka, which is nice. We have 10 Magna Guard shots. How do we have that? Mm, I don't know, but okay. Uh, we got a... Oh, there you go. Play a level up. Level 41. Uh, purchase three store shipments. I haven't done that already. Okay. Um, go in here. No. Uh, is there anything we need? No. We'll, we'll be able to get some more um, new gun ray shards today. And yes, in here, who I'm going to be farming, guys, is obviously Poggle the Lesser. Because we need Poggle for our Separatist side. Bam. And we're going to need a data card. We're going to open a lot of data cards here. Whoa, okay. So we can promote him. That's handy. I'm just trying to get all the dailies done quick, guys. Like, really quick in the episode here. So we can do a Galactic War run over, like, a time lapse if we get far. If we don't get far, guys, then it's probably just going to be a small time lapse. So, yeah. All right. So, can we do a score in another two minutes? All right. So, we're going to do our first Galactic War battle right here. Hmm. Maybe are you re maybe you are ready now. But I didn't. But I, di I doubt it. Let's. Let us see how you do. Okay. I can't read. <laughs> This is the Galactic War table. You can attempt to defeat this table only once per day. Make it count. You will play a series of, of battles against other players' squads. It will start easy and get harder the further you progress on the battlefield. Important. The health of each character carries over from battle to battle. Keep this in mind. Also, any units that are defeated during a Galactic War cannot be used on this table for the rest of the day. Defeated units can, of course, be used on other tables, just not here. Your Galactic War resets. After each successful battle, you will be able to open a special reward chest. The, enjoy the spoils of war. The further you progress, the greater the rewards. Be sure to check the table's Galactic War store to redeem the Galactic War tokens you've earned. Let's see if you have what it takes to survive the war. Alright, so basically what happens if we complete this battle right here... We get that little silver chest right there, and then we get a reward. And the more uh, chests we get, the more rewards. And when we have, I think it's 400. Yeah, if we have 400 of those tokens, we can get some shards for players. So we're obviously going to go in with our most powerful squad, guys. I don't really have a second squad. I just have this, so it's going to have to count. 
All right, let's stun Leia. Okay, she's nearly dead. Uh, take Luke. All right, this is easy. Well, no, I'm not going to say it's easy straight away, but it's easier than the squad arena, so that's all right. All right. Chewie can't taunt because he's got buff immunity. That's the helpful thing about having TIE Fighter pilots. All right. Okay. Oh, and by the way, guys, the reason why I'm going for Padme Amidala uh, when I reach level 85, the reason I'm going for Padme is because um, the real thing is that with General Kenobi being my favorite character in Star Wars, like, any day of the week, I just love General Kenobi as my favorite Star Wars character. So, yeah, I just, I can't really get General Kenobi because he's one of those raid characters where he takes a while, you just got to play the game for a while. We're not going to get him for a while, guys, a while. Then I'm going to go for a team for General Kenobi. So uh, what I thought, and I already know, is Padme is a good team with General Kenobi. I didn't want to just go for Padme because, one, she's like um, the Separatists are one of the first starting teams in the game. Like for um, like half a year now, that's been around, I'm pretty sure, over half a year. Uh, they're like one of the most popular starting teams with the Phoenix. I only want to get Padme so I can have a um, a Kenobi side, so I can actually use Kenobi. Because Kenobi's actually my favorite character. I'm actually being serious. He is my favorite character in Star Wars. So, I just want to say that out loud, just so you guys know. I'm not just doing it because it's one of the starting guides. Um, and um, like some people are questioning, uh, will there be what well, I want in the game? I've been watching uh, this famous YouTuber that does Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes videos, Arnold, uh, Arnold T101. Um, he predicted in his video that um, uh, like for some new characters, like a General Kenobi on Mustafar or something, and then like an uh, Anakin, if they were Galactic Legends, which I'm being serious right now, if they were Galactic Legends, I would so go for them. Like I'd probably, I wouldn't skip Padme. I'd probably still go for Padme, but then after that, I'd go for General Kenobi or Kenobi because Kenobi's actually really cool and I actually really like Kenobi. Anyway, guys, if you were looking at the actual gameplay, I have defeated two teams already. This is our third team that we're battling right here. And uh, to be honest, I actually got a uh, hundred of those tokens if you didn't see it. After this battle, we won't get any, but I'll show you that I have a hundred tokens already. Let's heal up. We want to heal up as much as we can, guys. Especially when someone's low. So we can, um... So we can uh, stay our health for the next battle. Keep our health for the next battle, because like the guy said, or the narrator, or the tutorial it said that um the health carries over to the next battles i know this as well because i do have a different account and i'm like nearly level 85 i'm so close to level 85 on that but um yeah so we want to keep our health and uh got three darth sidious shards so that's pretty cool and we got some more stuff all right so yeah as you can see i got 100 tokens when we complete this one we get that silver chest we will get another 100. Um, I'm going to see you guys when this Galactic War... Actually, yeah, I'll probably time-lapse this Galactic War battle, so I'll see you at the end of that.
Okay, everyone, so it doesn't seem that I could get past this battle right here. I actually got past the whole Galactic War, as you might have seen right there. We're going to try pretty much the last line we have, the last people we have to fight. It's not going to work, I know that, but we're just going to try to see if we get lucky. Because if we did right here, if we did beat this right here, I would legit, like screaming excitement because you get 400 of the tokens from this battle but i knew we weren't gonna win that bigs i didn't see the bigs i thought it was wedge even though wedge is good anyway but uh i just failed but anyway guys we got 100 xp right there 
We got 800 of the token things, so. Uh, can we do the first order now? Oh, we can. We can, we can, we can. Uh, we'll quickly grab some Poggle shards right here. So we can pretty much say we can get 20 shards each day. So that's two, four, six, eight. So in four days, we'll have our Poggle, which is all right, I guess. I mean, it's not the best, but it'll have to do. And we'll do no refreshes on this. See if we can get some shards. Oh, four times four shards. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. And do we need any gear? What level again? 43, yeah. Oh, uh, we can do this another two times. That would be insane if I did this twice. We'll do this and... We'll do this. And why not just do another upgrade on that. We'll do... At the end of each of these turns... Yes, do that. Uh, can Ahsoka have anything? No. Do... No, we don't need his leader ability. I really want to take Chewie up, but I can't. I could probably get that, and I could get that. So if I can just request some of these things uh i can donate that but um yeah i think that's gonna end off our episode here today guys um i am gonna do this off camera the first order event because i can't wait and um i have to get another video out and i don't know if i'll be able to upload this tomorrow i'm gonna have to see but um yeah so anyway guys if you did enjoy today's video make sure to subscribe uh, for more, uh, turn that notification bell and never miss a video, and, uh, I'll see you all in the next one. I know I just messed up my outro, but, um, anyway, I'll see you all in the next one. Bye-bye.